Well, hello, hello, hello. This is Victoria Lowe, and I'm back with another video, which means another color. And you want to be sure to stay tuned because you're in for a treat. Let's mix it up. Mix it. Lipstick man. Mix it. Lipstick man. Mix it. Mix it. Before we get into things, I want to send a special thank you to Dossier for sending me two beautiful scents this month. The first scent that they sent me is Oriental Sage, which is very reminiscent of the Tom Ford effing fabulous, okay? <laughs> and it smells amazing. So if you're into that scent, you would definitely love Oriental Sage. It smells amazing. So the next scent that they sent me is the Oriental Oak Moss, which is very reminiscent of the Chanel Coco Mademoiselle. And it smells so dainty, so nice. I absolutely love. Also with Dossier, the affordability of their scents range from $29 to $59. And the comparison of the original perfume is very spot on. They also offer free returns and exchanges forever. They sell in bulk on their website and they offer three free shipping for three or more bottles. Now let's get into this beautiful blue. This color that is inspired by the Grecian city Mykonos. Oh my gosh, I just had to name it that. The blue just reminded me of the ocean. First, I'm going in with nine tablespoons or nine tads of base. I'm going to be making it on a smaller scale. If you don't know by now, you can grab this base from my website, verivelobeauty.com. Okay? <laughs> but yes, I'm working on a smaller scale today, but I also mentioned you can use nine tablespoons if you want to make this blue on a bigger scale, on a larger scale. But I'm going in with nine tags, and now I'm going in with four tads of the titanium dioxide and on a larger scale you can easily do four tablespoons of titanium dioxide i give you guys a breakdown of the ratio from large to small in my previous video so be sure to check that out and right now what i'm doing is i'm just folding in that white first before I take my hand mixer and blend it in. The hand mixer is gonna do the work for me as per usual. And now I'm going in with seven tads or seven tablespoons of the blue number one, Alum Lake. And I'm just adding it to my bowl prior to me folding it. And I'm gonna fold it in first and then mix it out with my hand mixer. <laughs> It usually has like a green undertone to it. So I'm gonna cancel that out by adding in two dashes or two teaspoons of the FDNC Red Number 40 Alum Lake. And I'm just gonna blend that out really good. And what it does is it decreases the green in the, the green undertone and takes it out. And boom, that's where I am. And I absolutely love it. So I'm gonna finish this shade off with nine tads or nine tablespoons of the kaolin clay because remember I went in with nine tads of the base so that's equal parts and I'm just gonna fold this in and I'm going to add in my ISO next. it to this paste consistency that is what you want that's what you want to be on the lookout for you want to go ahead and add in three tags of the iso delta cane remix a little goes a long way so if you're working with a larger batch add it in at one tablespoon at a time and blend it out until your product comes back to cream a nice cream liquid consistency that a liquid lipstick should be and it will look something like this it should look like this and once it looks like this you can go ahead and add it to the syringe and bottle up your product 
and I'm just adding it to the back end of my syringe, getting it prepared for my bottle. Now I made a cute little bottle for the sake of this video with my Cricut machine. <laughs> Don't laugh. <laughs> But it came out cute and I love it and I really want to explore using my Cricut machine more, especially with products like this. So I just made me a cute little bottle. And here's another tip. If you see any air bubbles in your bottle or streaking, I didn't have any streaking, but if you were to ever see a white streak or any type of streak in your bottle, you could take a sanitized pipette and just simply massage it out prior to putting on the stopper. So right now I'm just putting some pressure on the stopper and then I'm gonna insert my wand. And just like that, you have a flawless bottle of lipstick. Liquid matte lipstick. Yes, indeed. My little Cricut letters came out cute. Yes, Cricut. <laughs> But yes, I'm just going to put this, apply this beautiful Mykonos blue to my lips. And I love the feel of it. It dries in seconds. So I like putting, my lips were a little chapped. So I should have did like a lip scrub. Be sure to scrub your lips first. Condition your lips because it would make a big difference. But yes, I love the way the shade came out. It is so, so, so pretty. Oh my gosh, I paired it with this black ensemble and it just really popped. But yes, you guys, this Saturday, join me for my first Let's Mix and Sip virtual group session. This Saturday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, October 23rd. Bring your own bottle so that we can mix, sip, together relax as a group is something that we all need right now and i feel like it's going to be really really fun for us lipstick besties to come together and have a little fun and unwind so please join me be sure to go to my website verivelobeauty.com to grab your tickets and i hope to see you this saturday night at eight love you and as always stay blessed